Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. So I'm back with my OG skincare video, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how I get unready. Basically, how I remove my makeup and what skincare I use. So basically, I do this after I've done like my shoots and everything. So this is like after my morning routine and before my nighttime routine. So yeah, let's get into the video. So firstly I'm just uh, taking this scrunchie and putting it in my hair because I want to get all of my hair out of my face. Next I'm taking this micellar cleansing water from Simple and I'm just taking it on a cotton pad and just removing my mascara and my eye makeup. As you can see I've not done a lot of makeup that day. So uh, I also wore a water not what? I did not wear a waterproof mascara that day so I was just removing with a non oil based makeup remover so this is basically what I do when I don't wear um, waterproof mascara basically a washable mascara so as you can see yes I've taken all my eye makeup out and I'm just removing a little bit of face makeup as well Then I'm going into the double cleansing system and I'm using this face shop oil cleansing water and I'm just taking that and I'm just rubbing it all over my face and I'm just melting all of my makeup down. Now I love this step you guys. I highly recommend if you are a makeup lover and you wear makeup, you should get this product because it makes your life so easy. Just one thing that I would advise is that don't put it like near your eyes a lot because I've done that mistake and it gets into my eyes and it just becomes really irritating so don't do that but except for that just remove all of your face makeup and everything from it and then I'm just emulsifying it a little bit with water you can see and it emulsifies so nicely you guys and it literally just there's not a speck of that product left when I wash my face that's how amazingly it emulsifies for face wash i'm using this low ph good morning gel cleanser from causarex and it's such a good gentle cleanser now my skin is sensitive and it is acne prone so right now because of i like i'm ill and because of that i'm breaking out a lot like you can see my skin is breaking out so i'm using this cleanser and for toner i am using this isn't tree green tea fresh toner now i've recently got my hands on this one and this is a very very light consistency and like very water like toner but as you can see it has such a deep color that's because it has the goodness of green tea and I love green tea you guys and it instantly soothes my skin so so much. I love this one. So if you're a person who likes physical scrubs, these two are amazing you guys. So this one is more on the affordable side. This is from Face Shop and then this one is from Kama Ayurveda. It's their Kumkumadi scrub and oh my god I love this one as well. Then for serum I'm gonna use this L'Oreal Revite Lift Hyaluronic Acid 1.5 Serum. I don't really remember the exact name but I'll leave it on the screen but this serum you guys have been loving it it's such a good serum it intensely hydrates my skin and as you know hyaluronic acid is a humectant so what it does is it actually traps the moisture from around the air into your skin and it makes it look really plump for the cream, I'm going in with this gel cream from Face Shop. It's the Chia Seed Hydro something cream and it looks like this. It's a very very lightweight gel based cream but it intensely moisturizes my skin. Like It is like an aqua bomb for your skin. It's such a good cream. If you're oily, if you're acne prone, if you have sensitive skin, basically all of your skin types, like all of the skin types out there can use this cream. It's such a good cream. Definitely recommend. Of course, you cannot forget your SPF guys and this one actually namely sent me some of the products so I'm just trying them out and I love the packaging. It's a frosted glass packaging and this is a mattifying sunscreen although I didn't find it very mattifying but I loved, loved this sunscreen. As you can see, it comes in a spray form but I was just spraying it on my hands to see what the texture is like and what it looks like. 
and it is such a good texture you guys you can see my skin looks so hydrated no white cast whatsoever like not a speck of white cast and it's such a nice sunscreen i loved it and it has spf 30 so it covers you really well in that matter also and i really really love the sunscreen like definitely definitely would recommend so guys that was it for my post makeup removal skincare routine and that's what my skin looks like i think it looks comparatively really nice and hydrated and don't worry about the pimples it's just because i'm ill and yeah i'm just saying that to myself don't worry about the pimples but i'm just using this lotus lip balm which is like a little bit tinted and i love this one i love how it gives my lips that a little bit of like a strawberry tint and i absolutely love this one not much hydration though but i love the look so yeah that was it for the video and i hope you guys liked it i hope you guys like my recommendations also i'm planning to film my morning and nighttime skincare routine again because i have changed a lot of products in that and yeah thank you for watching this video i'll see you the next time my old lovers fall into my covers Where they sink one by one